Pinboy Weather 12 now. We bring in meteorologist T.J. Del Santo. And uh, we need the rain, T.J. We're getting a lot of it today, <laughs> it seems. Uh, the good news is we're getting it on a Wednesday. And as we get closer to the holiday weekend, it'll be out of here. The uh, weekend just keeps getting better Great. and better. It looks like fabulous right now. But yeah, we're dealing with the rain now. Certainly much needed. Let's get a look at Newport. Here's Newport Harbor. Uh, certainly not a boating day, that's for sure. But we have... Uh, Plenty of rain continuing to work its way through the area. Here's another look outside. Here's Narragansett and the beach. Certainly not a beach day either. Live radar, maybe some slightly heavier rain currently working through portions of the area up uh, near uh, Foster and Situate, all the way down into Coventry and West Greenwich, right down 95. This is heading on off to the east and northeast. Live radar showing the uh, trend of the precipitation. This big old area of rain working through. We're going to see a bit of a break over the next several hours and it'll just uh, tend to be just some scattered showers right into the evening hours. Our threat tracker for today, low chance for any severe weather, just for some plain old rain uh, Thursday and Friday, looking pretty quiet as well. Temperatures right now at 66 in Smithfield, 68 Providence, Newport 68, upper 60s to around 70 degrees in southeastern Mass. Satellite radar picture showing this chunk of rain associated with this frontal system currently pushing through the northeast. Behind the the front it eventually will get into some drier air, which will you'll really notice that come uh, over the uh, upcoming weekend. There's another front behind this one pushing on through. Meanwhile, we've got this system spinning over here in the Atlantic. This is Omar. You can see that circulation right in there. All the thunderstorms remain off to the east of the center of circulation. Now, Omar, barely a tropical storm. It has winds of 40 miles an hour. You can see the history of it right in here. We are expecting Omar to work its way away from the United States. Really no impact on us. It certainly has been a busy hurricane season, however. Hour by hour forecast for the afternoon and into the evening. I'm going to take you right into 3 o'clock. Still some showers in the area. They're tapering off, I think, by early evening. Here we are at 8 o'clock on Thursday morning. I'm thinking there still could be some rain showers around. Remember that cold front I showed you? That'll be in the neighborhood tomorrow morning. Could be a few showers here and there. In the afternoon, I think we're primarily dry with partly sunny skies. Notice some more rain showers popping up back in here. We could be finding some more showers coming through Thursday night and early on Friday morning, and that will allow the uh, dew point, the uh, humidity to drop as we go through the daytime on Friday, setting us up for a great weekend. Forecast for today, we are looking at the rain to taper off to showers, temperatures, upper 60s and lower 70s. For tonight, looking at a low down into the upper 60s, a little on the muggy side side with showers possible really throughout much of the night and then into tomorrow showers early on and then we're looking at a blend of clouds and sunshine it'll be a little warmer and you'll notice a little extra humidity around as well temperatures about uh, 85 here's our seven day forecast again a brief shower tomorrow mainly in the morning on friday uh, still uh, looking at some warm temperatures, but the humidity falls a little bit throughout the day. Look at that weekend, Saturday, Sunday, and Monday. We are looking at plenty of sunshine. Temperatures each day in the upper 70s to around 80 degrees. Uh, each day also featuring low humidity, and it looks like that may carry over into the uh, day on Tuesday. All right, a little bump in the road today. Next six days after that looks awesome. Great.